Hey guys, Dan Burnham here with danburnham.com. I'd like to play you a little tune just a little bit. Then I want to stop and take some time with you. There we go. Well, we got through it, didn't we? I want to, first off, wish all of you a very Merry Christmas and hope that you have a Happy New Year. It's my, my prayer that all the needs in your life be met and you never have to go without or want. I want to take this time as we end the year and and Give some shout outs and some special thank yous to some people that's been very instrumental in my life. First off, I would like to thank Derek and Leslie Sadak at Legends of Brass Mouthpieces, located there in Lenore City, Tennessee. I'm thankful for my friendship with them. Uh, it's been a great, great ride so far. Legends of Brass, they're good people. Um, I think they're the best mouthpieces out there, I'm sorry but I, I just like Legends Brass. And so I want to thank them for uh, working with me, uh, incredible customer service, and beyond that, incredible people. And uh, I'm so thankful for them. Also, I would like to uh, give a special shout out to uh, Lee Adams, Lee and Donna Adams with Callet Trumpets. Uh, Lee, thank you so much. Uh, He's the one that makes the, uh, designs the uh, Calet Jazz Gen 2 and the studio artist, various models. Lee, thank you for all the hard work that you've done and that you continue to do in producing quality trumpets. They're exceptional horns, and, and if you've never played one, you deserve the right to at least play one. If you're looking for another one, there you go, Lee. I had to throw the plug in. But now I'm thankful for Lee and Donna. They've been dear friends and uh, I appreciate everything that you stand for. They're quality people. They'll, Lee will work with you. And uh, so for that, I'm thankful. And I would also like to thank a special friend, uh, Lynn Nicholson. Uh, Lynn, thank you so much for the MF protocol and for being who you are. Lynn has been uh, an inspiration for me and also a Trumpet hero, you know, if you said, okay, you've got to, Maynard's no longer with us, who's who's the one that replaces him in my mind and heart? It would always be Lynn Nicholson, and he's a very gracious person, and I'm thankful for all that you shared with me, and I'm thankful for you sharing your knowledge, because in this day and age, Years gone by, so many artists would, wouldn't would reveal what they do, their secrets, or the techniques, that would be a better word. But I want to thank you personally, and, and I hope that uh, folks will continue on and, and continue to get the, the program that you offer, because it's an exceptional program, and it worked for me. And last but not least, I, I would like to thank uh, the subscribers on my YouTube channel. Thank you for subscribing and tuning in. I appreciate you uh, tolerating, if you will, my reviews. The whole purpose when I first started this, and this is, uh, was to, I wanted to give back something that I, I, I didn't have the benefit of. When I started playing trumpet, of course, the internet wasn't, uh, it was around, but it wasn't as popular as it is today. And so there was no one doing reviews on mouthpieces. And so uh, with uh, the help of uh, Derek with Legends of Brass, I started with that and uh, started reviewing the pieces and started you know, reaching out. And with uh, Lee, I had got the uh, horns that worked for me. I played the Holtons 
you know, everybody wanted to be uh, Maynard Ferguson. So if you want to be a Maynard Ferguson, you had to have an MF Holton, and I had several of those. But I ended up landing on the uh, Callet Jazz Gen 2 and the Studio Artist. And uh, like I said, they're the best horns that I have personally played that work for me. And then, you know, I went through a time where uh, I've worked with several teachers after coming back after laying off the horn for 34 years and uh, good teachers. And then when I, you know, went to the MF protocol, it was the, the key that unlocked the door from my high register playing. And through the process, uh, the good Lord has given me the privilege of working with other players that wanna learn how to play high, that maybe can't, or there's issues with the mechanics of the playing. And so I've been blessed to be able to help so many people in this endeavor, and I'm thankful for that. It's a ministry for me, and it's a way for me to give back. So to all of you, I wanna say thank you, and God bless you. May you have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.